what's up guys? Today we're gonna be installing this wheel and the plug and play paddle shifters for my IS300. This wheel is super rare. Um, I have had it since 2018, but I was waiting for the other parts. As you can see, the works belt, the paddle shifter kit. Also, super expensive and super rare. And then this horn button too, which is the final piece. Finally, I have all of those and now we're gonna be installing it. So let's see how it goes. Let me see the button. So what's so special about this wheel? What makes it so rare? Okay, so this is a personal Mio Grinta. I think this is a 350 millimeter. I'm not sure. Yeah. Because I bought this used. Well, I didn't buy it. Um, that's why it's special and these are super expensive and rare to find because I think they're discontinued. I'm not 100% sure. Do not quote me on that. Um, another reason why this specific wheel is very special to me is because this was a gift from one of my older brothers back home. He has a vertex wheel and he didn't need it. And he was like, yo, you want it? I said, sure. And back in 2018, he gave me this wheel. Yeah. And also you, you're making it uh, like a personal wheel, right? Like uh, piece by piece is like custom or yeah, uh, right? Like I said, if I want to buy like the whole wheel again, it's going to cost me a lot of money. And I'm not, I'm not willing to spend that much on a steering wheel right now. Yeah. But I got lucky with my paddle sister kit and the horn button. Okay. These, this was brand new. But the person who was selling it, he had it, he never installed it, and he sold his car. But that one was used, and I got a good deal on it, and it works, and everything's great. That's one. Brand new on these? Bro, oh my god. Mm. Try looking up on eBay for a personal horn, but you see how expensive this shit is. <laughs> Alright, Harvey, so first thing, we're trying to do a tutorial. First step is... Um, taking the airbags off. Yeah, and taking the the battery off, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so T20. It's off. You know what I did? Put my finger in the blowout. Yeah, no, yeah. Yo, uh, Fluffy, which one you have to take out? Which clip? This clip. You literally just pop it. Yeah. And it comes right out. And then there should right. be two white clips inside. There's one ground right here for the horn. Boom! Just take this one out. I don't know how to take it out. I'll just let Harvey do it, and then we gotta take this out, and then this one out. Alright. And then we get to the clock spring. And then the 19 mil bolt. Make it loose. And then, yeah. There you go. So once that's out, then you want to um, loosen the, the, 19, 19. the 19 mil. And then it's going to be the fun part. Where you got to just wiggle it out. Yeah, this thing always loose. Until she her mouth. All right, so we took the steering yeah, wheel out. Right. You have to wiggle it. Now you got to you unscrew those two bolts that Harvey just took out. What she said? No, I'm just talking to the vlog. Next cover because there's a plug here. We got to put a, a relay for the airbag. So if not, the airbag yeah, is going to stay on. We have to put a resistor on it. The, the kit already provided me so that my dash doesn't so, uh, show a. Uh, um, Airbag, airbag. yeah. Warning. For that. All right, so underneath there's one more bolt, I believe. She's throwing it inside. As you can see, my forehead is glazing <laughs> with sweat. Yo, it does. This yellow clip right here. So in order for you to get the airbag uh, clip out, you gotta undo this and then. How you, how you take the clip out? Because Harvey was struggling. Uh, you just pull it. Up. Yeah, pull it down. Oh, okay. And so then pull it down. There you right. go. That's Easy. The uh, that's the airbag resistor. Okay. We put it on and it doesn't give you a signal. No, no need to plug it in. Just leave it up. Oh my god, it's kind of his sweat. Yo, look at my pants. <laughs> look at that. Look at all the sweat <laughs> drop on me. <laughs> it's, it's just glaze. Glaze. We're gonna make sure we tuck this. Yeah, it'll work, but you get a little bit of No, I need 
Make sure you talk the, what is it, the airbag resistor? Yeah, it's a resistor, so that it doesn't... And then now uh, you put the cover back on. And I imagine you're putting the three bolts back on. Yes, sir. And then the steering wheel. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's not too bad. I think you guys could do it back home. Yeah, it's a DIY. It's, yeah. you, got, you just gotta get the Works Bell paddle shifter kit for this car. Everything's plug and play on that. I was struggling the other day doing my hair. Yo. Harvey, why are you crying? Yo, I'm gonna throw sweat on you and you will feel it. I love it. <laughs> sweat in my mouth. <laughs> that, I, I clean Wait, my, my sweat. Thirst, daddy. Yeah. You okay? Your ass is on fire? Huh? Your ass is on fire? Yeah. So you gotta torque it to 30 foot pounds. Alright. This is not the ground, this is the active one. So let it be. No, this is a paddle shifter. Mm -hmm. This is the only one that's for the horn. That's what I'm I calling. know, but I think this is supposed to go there. No, this is supposed to go to the horn and the black one. Where's the horn? To. I'm not connecting it right now because this is the ground for the horn. I don't know how to figure it out to ground this. It's a loop. I think it's supposed to touch. It touches the metal thing. It's supposed to be. Okay, there's a cable there for ground. In there, con um, touching the hub and it worked because that's what happened with my Cedric. It didn't have a ground connected anywhere, but it was just touching. That's how the steering wheel looks like. I think it looks pretty sexy. I love the paddle shift carbon fiber ball. Harvey, if I duct tape that end, I can't. Uh, I'll do that because right now the My ass, bro. I saw you <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys. So that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully, you guys found this helpful. Um, it may not be the greatest, but we did our best with the tutorial. Uh, so, if you guys have any questions, uh, do not hesitate to DM me. Uh, I'm pretty sure he'll add the DM somewhere here. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, don't feel shy. Whatever questions you have about my car, any help you need, I'll try to help you out as yeah. much as I can. And we're about to do the my project on your car soon. The episode. Uh, I think we're gonna do Fluffy's car first. Is a right-hand drive uh, Honda, and then we'll do yours. So stay tuned, everybody. Like, yeah. share, and subscribe. Like he said, we'll see you on the next one.